Okay, so this is the entrance of the sterile hallway. Everything on this side is going to be cleaned and prepped for surgery on its move into the operating rooms. Um, from here, there's an entrance into the x-ray suite. So we can do mainly for post-operative x-rays once the patient comes out of the orthopedic procedure and go in and get a radiograph in this room. Um, make sure that all the implants are appropriately placed before moving on to the ICU. Uh, if there's any problem with the placement of the implants or with the fracture reduction, we'll bring it back in, take it back into the operating room. Um, there'll be sliding doors into each of these surgery suites. Um, this one is a clean orthopedic suite, so there are going to be two orthopedic tables in here. Um, we're just prepped now, we just got the medical gas in place, and uh, there's the supports for the surgery lights that are going to be installed in a couple of weeks. Um, the room is all prepped now to place the resin floor, so we'll have a, a resin floor that will come and it'll go right up the walls, and there'll be a fiberglass um, plastic barrier up above so this all can be washed down and kept uh, clean and re-clean. Um, this room here is kind of special procedures. Uh, it be clean orthopedic, we could use it for laparoscopy or, or um, uh, specialized procedures. So one, uh, one table in this room, we've got four different medical gas in here. We've got uh, oxygen, suction, medical air and nitrogen in this room so we can do laser procedures in here and, and keep the patient on medical air. Um, this room is designed for two tables so um, we would put two typically neuro cases in here could, could go at a time. Um, so room in here for two tables. We've got the slides in place for the new um, sliding glass doors so here's the, the mechanism. These doors will have a glass uh, piece that we can slide out of the way and then it'll, it'll slowly close again to keep the doors and the rooms closed off. Um, this room is a, uh, again, a special procedures room. Um, it's the furthest from any contamination. Um, so we'll do procedures like hip replacements and pacemakers and the walls are shielded with lead so that if we're using uh, fluoroscopy in here, uh, basically a, a video style x-ray we can do it in this room and the room is uh, is shielded again we've got these mechanisms in place in this area we're going to have um, storage for the surgery suites this will be a, a whole area for instrument prep and sterilization there'll be more instrument prep over along this side um, the surgical sub scrub sink will be over here And it's nice, we can see actually right from the suite through the windows into the ICU, into the new runs that we've seen all the way into the cat ward from here. So um, we're trying to keep it as visually connected to the rest of the hospital as possible.